And Keith, when we first did the story, it was shortly after Phil Colello had the procedure done, so the toe thumb was pretty swollen. And while doctors anticipated his recovery would go well, things could still go wrong. Today, though, Phil is a pretty happy camper. Six months ago, doctors at St. Francis Hospital and Medical Center replaced Phil Colello's left thumb with his left toe after an accident severed the hairdresser's thumb. Today, the reattached blood vessels and nerves. So this is starting to feel real good. Very huh? much. From You touch this, it goes right down. Awesome. Have the toe turned thumb functioning. Before it would stop about here, but now I can almost bring it to there. I would say on a scale from 1 to 10, he's probably about an 8. His plastic surgeon, Dr. Sam Wanacore, specializes in hand and microsurgery. There is a little bit less motion in his IP joint, that's this guy right here, uh, than I would like, and we could offer him something to uh, potentially enhance that. Your toe is not used to moving that way either. And, you know, we might be able to correct it, but right now it doesn't bother me. Still, pain in Phil's left foot the foot now missing a big toe, has him sitting more than standing. That continues to improve. It's lower extremity. Feet take longer to heal than the rest of our body. It's Therapy. Give it all you got, Phil. Keeps Phil on track. But even on this side now, the sensation's coming back little by little. But not enough, so Phil must be vigilant about avoiding accidents. Uh, in the beginning, I was making uh, some chili, and I started including my thumb in it. You know, so now I keep my eyes on it real, real good. He has a very functional hand, and I, I believe it all comes from Phil's attitude. Occupational therapist Timothea Kimball. He came in here, he said, I, this is my new thumb and I need to use it and I'm ready to, I'm ready to use it. And not a bad looking thumb at that either. I was lucky, I got a decent looking toe. <laughs> you know, it looks more like a thumb than a toe. It's still a little bit swollen, but he's working on that. Dr. Bonacorp tells me Phil's foot will likely improve without the need for more surgery. Meantime, Phil is able to do whatever he wants to do with the thumb he has. Anne.